I am back to do our big book today, okay? Now remember, this is our phonemic awareness book and it does go kind of fast. So just do the best you can at home to keep up with me because I know that it's a fast paced curriculum. I am gonna do my part and your part. When it's your turn, I'm gonna point to you, okay? Are you ready? We are gonna start with rhyme recognition. I am going to say a word and then ask you which word rhymes with that, okay? Which word rhymes with me, C or you? C. Which word rhymes with way, so or day? Day. Which word rhymes with high, by or low? By. Which word rhymes with go, yes or no? No. Which word rhymes with new, net or do? Do. Okay, now we're gonna move on to onset fluency. I am gonna say three words and I want you to listen for the first sound you hear at the beginning of the word, okay? So I'll say the three words and then you tell me that first sound that they all start with. Are you ready? Jaw, juggle, just. J. Rocket, rush, round. R. Find, fix, family. Master, metal, most. M. Mm. Beach, balloon, bite. B. All right, and we are gonna move on to blending the body and the coda of a word, okay? So, if I said te n, you would repeat that. Te n, and then put it together. Ten, okay? Let's get started. Me, s, your turn. Me, s, mess. Here's another one. Who, p, your turn. Who, p, hoop. Let's do a couple more. Ta, p, your turn. Ta, p, tap. Let's do two more. Ready? La, k, your turn. La, Luck. And the last one. Ha, t. Your turn. Ha, t. Hat. Very good. Now we're going to move on to listening for the final sound in a word, which is the last sound at the end of a word. Okay? So I'm going to say three words, and I want you to listen for the last sound, and you're going to tell me what that sound is after I'm done. So if I said kite, met, pot, you would say because all those words end the same. Are you ready? Nap, zip, mop. P. Rub, sob, fib. B. Gold, head, side. D. Change, large, age. J. Last one. Sum, him, climb. Mmm. All right, let's keep going. We are gonna go on to segmenting a word into the onset and the rhyme, okay? So I am gonna say the word, like I might say tap, and you would repeat me, tap, and then you're gonna segment it. Tap, okay? Let's get started. Map, your turn. Map, ma, p. All right, the next one is Peak, your turn. Peak, p, eek. Okay, let's do a couple more. Nod, your turn. Nod, n, odd. You might notice that when we're breaking it into the onset and the rhyme, the onset is the very beginning of the word and the rhyme is the rest of it, okay? That's why it was nod, n, odd and peak was p, eek. Okay, let's do two more, are you ready? Rate, your turn, rate, r, eight. Last one, win, your turn, win, w, in. All right, and we are now going to add a phoneme to a word, and a phoneme is a sound. So, 
if I had ought and I added to the beginning, the word is hot. Okay, let's keep going. At, add b to the beginning, and the word is bat. At, add s to the beginning, and the word is sat. At, add to the beginning, and the word is hat. At, add k to the beginning, and the word is cat. One more. At, add m to the beginning, and the word is mat. All right, now we're going to take a sound away. We are going to delete a sound. So, for example, if I had the word mat, okay, and I took away the m, what's left? At, right? Let's keep going. So, I have the word ham without the is am. Fit without the f is it. Pod without the p is odd. Rug without the r is ug. And one more. Key without the k is e. And now it is time to change the phonemes. We are gonna change the sounds, okay? So, if I had the word pay, you would say pay, okay? And then I would tell you to change the p to w. What's the new word? Way, okay? So let's keep going. C, change the s to w, and the word is we. My, change the m to b, and the word is by. Moo, change the m to z, and the word is zoo. B, change the b to n, and the word is knee. Toe, change the t to j, and the word is Joe. All right. Very good job. We are now going to practice our letters. I've got all of my ABC cards here and they are out of order. Okay. So just like we always do, I am going to point to the letter and say letter is point to you. You tell me the letter. I point to the letter again. I say sound is I point to you and you tell me the sound. Are you ready? Letter is J. Sound is J. Letter is P. Sound is p. Letter is z. Sound is z. Letter is i. Sound is e. Letter is l. Sound is l. Letter is w. Sound is w. Letter is t. Sound is t. Letter is r. Sound is r. Letter is s. Sound is s. Letter is D. Sound is D. Letter is N. Sound is N. Letter is H. Sound is H. Letter is C. Sound is K. Letter is U. Sound is U. Letter is Q. Sound is Q. Letter is V. Sound is V. Letter is Y. Sound is y. Letter is x. Sound is x. Letter is k. Sound is k. Letter is b. Sound is b. Letter is o. Sound is a. Almost done. Letter is f. Sound is f. Letter is a. Sound is f. Letter is g. Sound is g. Very good, boys and girls. We've got one thing left, okay? We are starting a brand new poem this week for our language awareness. So I am going to start out by saying a couple lines of the poem and you need to repeat me at home, okay? Every day we're gonna add a little bit more until we've got the whole poem down. This poem is called Hickory Dickory Dock. Are you ready? 
Hickory Dickory Dock. Hickory Dickory Dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The mouse ran up the clock. And that's it. Tomorrow we'll add more. Thank you so much for joining me for our big book today. I will see you tomorrow to do it again. Bye-bye.